Hi, I'm Pastor Jack Mantrick, pastor at Central United Methodist Church in Waterford, Michigan. Each Sunday, we produce uh, message notes that accompany the message on Sunday morning. You can fill in the blanks, write in the margins, whatever is helpful for you. And then you can uh, have it and keep it uh, for the five days of devotional material, Monday through Friday. And today uh, is our, would be my daily devotion for Monday, July 20th. We're going to speak about, uh, throughout this week, sibling rivalry, uh, based on the story of Cain and Abel, the very first children of, of history uh, in our scriptures. Uh, have you ever experienced uh, sibling rivalry? It, um, it is a thing that each of us have, uh, even if we haven't had children, we probably experienced it as children, unless you're an only child. But uh, even then, you can have some type of sense of what that looked like as you related to your classmates in early, element, early elementary school. Sibling rivalry is a competition between, uh, especially, uh, between siblings, especially for the attention, the affection, and the approval of their parents. And according to a, a study by uh, Dr. Judith Dunn, children as young as one year old are sensitive to the differences in how parents treat uh, the children. Now, I've read over time that uh, most, most uh, sibling rivalries disappear uh, as uh, children enter into adulthood. Uh, but uh, the fact is, uh, sometimes then that rears its head. Uh, as one uh, author said, <laughs> they end up in court fighting for their share of the inheritance. That is to say that sibling rivalry is real. And because the Bible is based in reality, uh, there is sibling rivalry in our scriptures. There was the conflict between Jacob and Esau, uh, sibling rivalry since the time that they were born. They were twins. Uh, then there was Joseph and his brothers. Remember, uh, Joseph's brothers sold him. Uh, well, first they threw him in a pit, and then they sold him into slavery. Uh, then uh, in the book of Numbers, we're told that Miriam uh, had uh, some consternation against her brother uh, Moses because she felt she'd been left out of, uh, of the happenings of their people. It's real. It's real today. It was real 2,000 years ago. It was real 5,000 years ago. But perhaps the most uh, famous story is the story between Cain and Abel, which led to murder. <laughs> Cain killed Abel. We're going to read that scripture tomorrow and deal with it a little more in depth. But for today, I want you to think about uh, sibling rivalry. Think about your siblings and how you've related to them over time. Uh, did you have that type of rivalry when you were younger? How did you grow out of it? How do you relate to your siblings today? Or how do you imagine those relationships would be in terms of uh, relating to one another? This is important for us as the church because we, we proclaim ourselves to be brothers and sisters in Christ Hmm, brothers and sisters in Christ, could it be that there might even be sibling rivalry within the church? Friends, think about these things, meditate upon them. Uh, I hope to see you tomorrow for Tuesday's daily devotion. Let's pray. Gracious God, we thank you for this day. We ask that you be with us in, the, in these middle summer days as the weather is warm and we are so ready to go outside and experience your creation. <laughs> and yet sometimes it's really hot to be outside. But we, we receive the blessing of the good earth that you give to us. And the ability during this COVID-19 pandemic to get outside, breathe freely the air, and uh, get some exercise and enjoy your creation. Gracious God, we thank you for today. In Christ's name and in the power of your Holy Spirit. Amen. Have a great Monday, friends. God bless.